Welcome back learners to our channel, Robo Army. In today's video, we are going to learn how to interface an infrared sensor or we can say IR sensor with an Arduino UNO to create a simple object detection system. We will also control a buzzer and an LED based on the sensor's output. So, let's start. Alright, here are the components we'll be using for this project. Arduino UNO which is used to control our LED and buzzer. One IR sensor having three pins. If you want to know more about the IR sensor, just click on the I button and go through our previous video. Next, we need one 5 volt small buzzer where this larger pin is positive and smaller is negative. 1 LED 1 resistor For building a temporary circuit, we need one breadboard. USB cable to upload code to Arduino And some jumper wires Now Let's quickly go through the connections before we jump into coding. Now insert male to female jumper wire to the IR sensor as shown in the video. Then insert the VCC wire to the power bus of the breadboard. Insert GND wire to the ground bus of the breadboard. At last insert the out wire of IR to any digital Arduino pin, like pin 9. Now insert the buzzer in the breadboard and connect the positive terminal of the buzzer to any digital pin of the Arduino like pin number 11 and the negative terminal to the ground bus of the breadboard. Insert one LED in the breadboard and connect the positive terminal of the LED to any digital Arduino pin like pin 13 and connect the resistor in between the negative terminal of LED to the ground bus of the breadboard. At last take to male to male jumper wires and connect them in between 5 volt of Arduino to the power bus of the breadboard and GND of Arduino to the ground bus of the breadboard. Now that we've got our circuit all set up, you can also verify your circuit according to this circuit diagram. Let's move on to the coding part. Now open the file if you've already downloaded the Arduino IDE, otherwise download the Arduino IDE first. Here you can see first we have to define the pin connections for the IR sensor, buzzer and LED. You may change the pin numbers here according to your connections in your circuit. In the setup function, we have to set the pin modes for the input and output devices. Here the IR sensor is an input device. The buzzer and LED are output devices. In the loop function, read the IR sensor's output and check if an object is detected. Now, we have to upload the code to our Arduino. Connect Arduino UNO to computer via USB cable. Select the correct board and port in Arduino ID. Click the upload button to upload code to Arduino. Let's test the circuit and see it in action. As I move my hand in front of the IR sensor, you can hear the buzzer sound and see the LED turn on, indicating the presence of an object. When I remove my hand, the buzzer and LED will turn off. Now challenge yourself. Initially switch on the LED permanently and make the buzzer off. Whenever an IR sensor detects any object, 
the LED should get off and buzzer should get on at that time without making any change in connections. Let's see how the small change in coding can give us the solution. As you know, high means on and low means off. So whenever IR detects an object, buzzer should be high. And make LED low here. Make LED high here. Upload the code. And let's see the output. So this is the magic of coding. In this video, we have successfully interfaced an IR sensor, Arduino UNO and used it to control a buzzer and LED. Subscribe to our channel for more exciting upcoming projects. Till then keep learning.